What is the best laptop to buy in 2020? That is a most definitely difficult question. Um, it depends on what you're looking for. If you're looking for like gaming, I don't, I don't know why I have that. Um, I'm never gonna find that. <laughs> anyway, it depends on what you're looking for. You're looking for office work, you're looking for gaming, but I'm just gonna do the all performance round pretty much. So it's, yeah. This video is awful already. The laptop industry is too high in prices. The cheapest, somewhat not even decent price uh, price for a laptop is as low as three ninety nine ninety nine U.S. dollars. Um, no joke. Laptops are clearly overpriced nowadays. Looking at you, Walmart. <clears throat> now, what are some other options? Well, that's where. Let me just cover the specs of this one. 8 gigs or 16 gigs of DDR4 memory. 240 gig SSD or a 500 gig SSD. Still upgradable. A 10 gigabit Ethernet jack. Intel Core i3 or i5, 7th or 8th gen. For under, guess what? 300 to 370. Wow. And this one is $400, this laptop right here, known as the Acer R15. 4 gigs of DDR4 RAM. Already went down 4 gigs of RAM. 64 gigs of raw storage. Dude, get out of here. And a cheap, dirty, quad-core processor. Oh, I said, oh my god, I said quad-core in nodes. I'm pretty sure it's not even quad. I don't know if that's right. I think it's actually, no, it is quad, shockingly. Oh, and it's DDR, LP DDR3. <clears throat> so it's not even DDR4. Are you kidding me? That, that's, that's pretty gross. And it's a Chromebook. Hey, uh, Google, um, can you kiss my butt? No, no. Chromebooks are gay! Anyway, um, <laughs> I'm sorry, but like, Chromebooks are awful. And the reason why the performance are a little bit better, I'll tell you a secret. I'll, just, I'll, I'll tell you that juicy secret. It's, uh, it's because I, um, they don't have screens. The money gets put into something else. That is literally the only reason. Okay, it looks like I'm doing something inappropriate. I'm not. I'm doing the um, bouncy leg thing. I don't know why. But, yeah, it's pretty ridiculous. Um, Walmart, you're a disgrace.